Welcome to Smoky CNC Woodworks. Today we're going to do a process that I've done once before, somewhat. You'll have to look back. I did one called a half tone, which was just a gadget upgrade for Vectric products. And it was free. You could just put it on there. And what that does is you can take a photo, it'll do all uh, diagonal lines in it and create an image in there. Well, since then, Vectric has put out the upgrade, which is called Photo Card. That way you can do a mesh or a crosshatch pattern, and it's supposed to bring out more detail. So that's what we're going to do today is a little bit of Photo Card. So let's go.
that was it. That was quite a long process. That was about an hour. Uh, you probably didn't tell because I probably sped this video up quite a bit. But I believe you can tell who it is. I mean, that is really cool. I, it amazes me how it brings that out. What was really scary about it, though, is the lines were so thin was the sanding. I didn't want to sand out the detail. So the eyes were real dark. In most all pictures of Abraham Lincoln are dark. If I do one of these in the future, or let me say when I do one of these in the future, I'm going to, <coughs> excuse me, I'm going to pick out a uh, photo that has more detail around the eyes that really pulls that out. And probably my other recommendation is, this is my good old birch plywood. My next time around, I will probably use a hardwood or a solid wood and just to keep the flaking down because some of this flaked out and probably wasn't supposed to. But for a whole, as a whole, I mean, it came out looking cool. I mean, it is just neat as could be. So I'll zoom in here and you can see the crosshatch pattern in the forehead. Wild. I mean, I don't know how that machine knows to do it. And, you know, just like everything else, halfway through, I'm sitting there thinking, this thing has messed up. This is trash. I better figure out something else to do. Came out all right. So, guys, that's going to be it for this week. If y'all haven't done so yet, please subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time.